All right, so I just got the brand new Fire TV Stick 4K. And I'm going to show you how to hook that up to a Vizio Smart TV. So first of all, we got to get all the parts out of here. And there ain't that many, really, to tell you the truth. I've already opened this up. It does have this directions. We don't need those. Here's your uh, controller. Um, here is your power source. And the power source goes right in the side, just like that. Up here, you've got a connector with HDMI, right? So you got to put the, these two pieces together here, like that. And I don't know why you couldn't just shove this in there, but they give you this so that you've got a little flexibility, right? And then this is your power cable, and it comes with a block and a USB connector, just like that. And bam, that's all you have right there. And now I'm going to go ahead and we're going to put it in uh, our Vizio TV and see how she works. All right, so this is the Amazon Fire Stick, TV Fire Stick 4K Ultra. And this is the newest one that they have. And I'm going to show you how to put the batteries in it. So what you have to do is you have to look at this thing. You're going to see that there's a little crease that goes all the way down and around here and then comes up. So that's your, this is your door back here. And there's a little bit of a depression right there. You see it? And that, and so there's, there, there, you know, the idea is, is you're supposed to push this and it opens. And you can see it kind of slid open. So if you look on the sides of this, this is kind of a tricky thing to open. So you're going to see that there's little grooves here, little catches. And that's how, you know, you got to look for that when you put it on and off. Sometimes it's hard to get off. So you're going to need, I believe these are AAA batteries. They're the smaller ones. And um, if you look in here, you're going to see the direction that you're supposed to put them. Now, usually your negative side always goes to where the plunger is. See how they have that little plunger there? And you'll notice that this one's a little bit different than the other Amazon Fire Sticks. So what you're going to do is put this in there like that. Just kind of, it's kind of snaps in too. Kind of catches it. Look, if I go like this, it won't fall out. So you're going to do that, and then you're going to get your other negative side here, and you're going to push it against it like that, and just pop it in. And now you've got both of your batteries in there. And then what you're going to do is you're going to take this, and what you want to do is you want to come away from here a little ways. So when you put it on, you got to put it on back here. You can put it on pretty far back too. And then you can you got to get it forward. Now you just slide it forward, and it's just going to make a click. Watch. And now it's ready to go. Now you can go ahead and do your your Amazon in. All right. So what I've done is plugged everything in already, and you guys saw me do that. So really, all I've got to do is hook this to the HDMI port and plug that into the power. So if I just pick this up and I bring it to the side here, I'm going to use this HDM because this is the side one, and I think that's the best one to use. So I've just got to look at the attitude of the way it goes in, and so I have to have my rounded part on the bottom like this. So i got to kind of turn it over like this. Let me show you. So I've got it this way, and there's the port. So now i got to come in and just kind of smush it in there. Now you could do this without everything all put on it already, if you want it to. There we go, I got it in. So that's pushed into that port, and this is all hooked up. And then I just gotta un unravel this a little bit. There we go. You can see I've got like some twists and turns in it, but. And I think we've got just enough room to get down here and plug it in. So let's go ahead and plug it in. Get that out of the way. And bam, now we're in. All right, so we're all set up, ready to go. And now we, all we gotta do is try it out. And uh, we're gonna grab our controller here. And we're just gonna come up. We've gotta turn the TV on, so we're gonna go do that first. And here we go. All right, so now the TV's on, because I had to use that controller for the Vizio. And it should open up right to this HDM port. And there's our fire stick. And it kind of looks like a Roku one. Searching for your remote. It's right here. Oh, you know what? I think we've got the batteries in here. So all I got to do is touch this. There. See it? Fire TV. Bam. Done. Bob's your uncle. Fire TV. All right. So apparently it wants me to press this thing here. And I want English, so I'm going to go to press English. And bam, we're configuring it right now. All right, so Fire TV is configuring, scanning for networks. 
All right, that's the one we want. Good. All right, now I got to put the I got to put the password in. So you guys are gonna just have to chill out for a second. All right, I put everything in. So now I'm just gonna hit connect, and it's connecting to my uh, yeah, connection is successful. Checking for updates. All right, it's taking forever. It's downloading the latest software. So that's going to take forever. And bam, now we just have to sign into our Amazon account. Sign into Amazon account. Enter activation code when prompted. If you want to sign into your account on your Amazon Fire Stick. All right, this screen will refresh when completed. Sign into your Amazon account at amazon.com code. So I got to go over to the computer and do that. All right, so there I am. I'm putting this in. Then I hit enter. I got to sign in first. All right, so now I got, so it takes me to this page after I've signed in. And so now I've got to put this code in here. So let's go back and get our code. All right, so I've entered the code. Uh, we'll probably have to blur it. And now I just have to hit continue. Success, registration is now complete. Now, if we go back in here, we should be good. Successful registration. Welcome, Lehman. Fire stick, blah, blah. Let's continue. Save the Wi-Fi passwords from Amazon. Yes. Continue. Checking for backups. Restore Fire TV. It looks like you're an existing Fire TV customer. Would you like to restore your Fire TV with your current apps, privacy settings. Restore, let's do that. All right, let's do that. Choose a device. Tom's fourth Fire Stick. Tom's third Fire Stick. I guess we'll just do the third one. Let's do that one. It shouldn't take long. Cha-ching! Your Fire Stick 4K is designed with kids and parents in mind. No, no, I don't need anybody. We don't got no kids. <laughs> Thank God. They're just a drain on your resources. Preparing for your remote setup. All right, we're preparing. Here we go. Let's remote it. Let's set up this remote. We'll be playing music during the next step. Please make sure the volume is turned up. Okay. That volume is up. With your Fire TV remote, point at your TV, toggle volume up and down volumes. Okay, so we gotta go. With your Fire TV remote, point at your TV, toggle the volume up and down. All right, where's the volume up and down on here? Oh, this must be it here, right? That must be it right there. So let's try it. Let's go down. That's working, right? So I hit lower and it goes down. I hit up and it goes up. All right, so that's good. Let's hit yes. Bam, done. Your Fire TV remote is now successfully set up. Okay. Okay, here we are. Choose your streaming services. Okay, get started. Everything is free to add. Some will require payment. All right, let's go to no thanks. <clears throat> Introducing the all-new TV experience. Menu, decide, blah, blah. Okay, got it. Just get me to the thing. Who's watching it? Tom is. Okay, we're in it, finally. All right, so we finally made it. Now you can go and navigate with this. You know, you can go up and down. You can go left. You can go right. Okay, uh, when you see something you want, like Netflix, you just press Netflix. And it should open Netflix up because it should have everything loaded in here for my other one, which means I should not have to put the um, the password because I have no idea what it is. <laughs> it's been so long since I put it in here. Oh, yeah, daddy-like. Oh, yeah, it looks like it's going to be good. Oh, look, get started. <laughs> Unlimited movies. So 
So I need to sign in. Looks like I'm going to have to sign into everything. Oh, shit. That's a nightmare. All right. So anyway, let's just go back here. All right. So anyway, we did it. We got it figured out. All right. If you like this video, subscribe to my channel and check out my other awesome videos. Peace out.